Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video. We're playing another game that just came out on Steam uh, on sale for the November Autumn Sales. This one's called Foreign Legion Multi Massacre. You're pretty much one of these soldiers here that you select and it's another one of those uh, zombie survival style games. Very similar to like zombies if you've ever played zombies in the Call of Duty Black Ops or anything like that. It's very similar to that but obviously more on a lower scale. Um, so what I would do is, is obviously nobody's playing this game, but you could still play by yourself. You don't have to have other people play. It would be nice if you did have other people play, but um, as far as the character creation goes, you have to purchase different gear for him. You can choose your skin colors. Um, I have $25,000 already that I've been, you know, since I've been playing and I'm almost level 3. So in essence, you can come in here, you know, and you can buy things. Like, for example, like if I want to buy a light on his head, it straps a little flashlight to his head, and there's like 25 different accessories you can purchase for your character. So we'll just buy that. And then, for example, if we want to buy some navy clothes, you know, or urban clothes, for example. Um, I'm not high enough level to unlock the next one, but we'll buy some urban clothes, and then we'll buy his urban helmet, just so that way he doesn't look too default there. And there you go. Okay, we'll go right into the multiplayer here. We've got the graveyard, the city, the carrier, the village, night ops, the pipeline, tons of different missions, and we'll start right here at the graveyard. The premise is there's a generator outside. You've got to keep the generator running while the zombies are trying to eat you. So that's pretty much the premise of this one. So we'll do a five minute game mode. We'll keep it on medium because it goes medium to extreme and since I'm by myself, we'll just keep it at medium for now. Oh no, you are surrounded by zombies. Yes we are. Keep the generator running to power the beacon. Basically we gotta keep that so the helicopter can show up, which is that. So the longer we keep the generator running, the heli helicopter knows where we're at. Okay, so the generator is right out there. That ghost, unfortunately, she's extremely hard to kill. I can't kill her by myself. So she always ends up cursing. It doesn't give me enough time to kill her. Like my little handgun that I'm shooting, it just does no damage to her. See? And then she curses you. And all it does is it just makes you walk really slow. Really so you've just got to be very careful when she ends up cursing. You can, in essence, shoot these guys in the head like this, but they're still not going to die. So you've got to move the generator. Down. So now what you got to do is you got to stand next to the generator to get it fired up again. Oh great, she's going to turn. And if you get yourself into some trouble, like we're about to be in already, you can go in and call in for some air support. Trying to get to the generator. We almost got it. Oh, now she cursed me. Here. Just hold on tight. No radio for backup. And just to show you that, where is she? There she is, right there. See, look, I'll show you real quick. So look at my gun. My my actual M16. I can kill her with that, but it takes like every single clip I've got to do it. So it makes it very, very challenging to kill her. So I just kind of leave her. If I had help, obviously I'd be kill her. And if the generator's down, like it is now, and we're in the dark, the zombies hit twice as hard. So you've got to get that generator up quick.
thing. Slow him down a little bit, and then we're going to call him for some more help. Just hold on tight. Help is on its way. Well, what's with the TV, but we're shooting it. We gotta go get our generator up. Come on, fire it up. Come on, fire it up, fire it up, come on. Okay. Now we gotta go get our stuff before she cur oh there's our ammo box. And there's some health. Nice. Yeah, she's gonna curse me again. Generator up and let's waste these guys. Okay, generator started. Get off me. Get off me. Now you can see why this game is. Oh man, again? Get off. Oh boy. Oh boy, they're gonna pin me up here again. At least I have a flashlight now. Generator running, it's connected to the GPS beacon. The rescue chopper can pick you up. I figured I'd read this to you guys real quick. The radio is in the shed. Use it for air support. Always keep the lights on. 
they're stronger and more zombies when it's dark. So yeah, this is kind of a place where you're really supposed to make your stand is right in here and let them funnel in, but they can break down the walls and I'm by myself and I'm scared, so I don't want to be in there. I think we got two more. One more. Oh, he was in the porta potty. Just like that. You've taken out your last zombie. The helicopter shows up because he located the beacon with the generator. Where it tallies up how much money you made. I made about $25,000 my last mission, so we'll see what I run this time. $17,000, another $12,000. Total money, $29,000. I made that mission, so I have $40,000 now. Then you can go through your ranking and your different player and stuff. And there you go. So now that you've got $40,000, you can go back to your character screen. And then you can see if you've unlocked anything else. Like right now, we just unlocked the jungle for $3,000. And we've also got <clears throat> some cigarettes now. We can put this on him. We can put a little... We'll put a little cigarette pack in his, on his helmet. Give him the whole full metal jacket look here. And then we'll give him the jungle. Once you buy it, you can go back to it, just so you know. But there you go. We've got our jungle guy. We've got our light. With a pack of cigarettes strapped to it. <laughs> We're official Vietnam War veterans now. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. This is Foreign Legion Multi Massacre. It's on sale on Steam right now. It's definitely worth the pickup. It's a pretty cheap game. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you later.